Hi, I am Victoria McLean and welcome to my rather large box channel. <laughs> This is box number two from Muckle Mannequins. Um, it's a little big, right? A little big, a little big. And just to give you a hint of what it is, here is uh, um, a little hint to what's inside this box as well. You only got a quick glimpse there, and I'm not gonna say any more, and, and, and the locket. Um, so if you'd like to see what's inside this rather large box, then keep on watching. <laughs> If you would like me to bring Hogwarts to you, then make sure that you subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that all-important notification bell as well. Let's get started. So in reflection to what I'm about to open, I am using, and of course recently we lost um, the wonderful Helen McCrory as well. Um, I have used it quite a few times, but I am being nagged to use it again. I am using the beautiful Narcissa Malfoy's wand played by Helen McCrory who left us way too soon. I think she was 52 and unfortunately passed away due to cancer. So I am using this beautiful wand in remembrance to her. I have used it a lot because I have commented so many times the fact that she was so amazing to use this wand in the films because it's not a comfortable wand. So hats off to her indeed. But as I always say, I'm gonna put it back before I break it. Now, of course, I could not open a box like this without having help. So, Janice, would you like to join me today? <laughs> if I must. If you must. So this box has been very kindly sent to me from Muckle Mannequins. Thank you so much. It's rather large, isn't it? Very large and very heavy. Because Janice is here and because we have a special guest with us, what do you think is inside this box? Let me know in the comments below right now. What do you think is in this box? Is it a niffler? We've had one of those. It's a rather big niffler. It's a rather it's big niffler, <laughs> isn't it? That doesn't vibrate. <laughs> Long story. Long story. Yeah, one day we'll tell you. Uh, become a patron and you might hear it on Zoom. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, this is this is very exciting, isn't it? It's um, you have the very first one of these, yes, don't I you? Do. Yeah. How long have you had that for? <sighs> Does say obviously what it is, but how long have you had that? For? I think they can guess, but I think about four or five years. I think maybe oh more. My gosh. Mm. And we mentioned that in the past video, and we how yeah. much that's gone up in value. Yeah, it's gone up quite a lot. Yeah. As we mentioned, Muckle Mannequins items are artwork. And as you saw from the Niffler, if you haven't seen the unboxing of the Niffler from Muckle Mannequins, then check out the link above. But the pieces are pieces of art and they're all officially licensed by Warner Brothers. So, yeah, shall we, um... <laughs> shall we you get... do the honours? Oh God, really? Right, first of all, let's, let's figure it. out where's, where's up. <laughs> we got to lay it flat, haven't we? So let's, let's move ah, the... there you go. Yeah. Let's move the camera. to lift it my god how are we gonna do I this now in cases. that's fine we can cope with that right should we lift we need to oh no hang on no. okay oh and i think actually he's going to be naked oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay <laughs> let's take his pieces out then very careful oh god this is heavy oh my god what are they it's to colour him if you chip him. No. Yeah, you get the paints. Just that is case. wicked. Yeah. Right. Go on, I'll let you take the polystyrene part out. <gasps> oh my god. He is a bit naked. Yeah, he's naked. <laughs> he's a bit naked. <laughs> right, let me grab the base. Oh. 
Can you manage? got him right put that to oh. one side remember what i said about packaging do not get rid of any packaging it is imperative that you keep it oh my god look at his little whiskers oh, his look at his eyes his hair's flat on the top oh my god dobby welcome home dobby <laughs> i give you i give you a good home Clothes because obviously we don't want Dobby left naked, do we? Do we, no, Janice? Definitely we not. Yeah, he's got his scruffy old oh pillowcase. Oh my god, look at that! The, the the lovely thing is though, it's actually better than the way right. it looked when he had. Um, he's got to have his legs through here. He's got to have his what through where? His legs go through here. Right. Sorry, I'm putting you putting your my hand in between <laughs> your legs, Dobby. <laughs> Please, just you know, mm. don't hate me. His eyes are so lifelike. Now, one of my Patreons had ha has this Dobby, and I couldn't watch her unbox. She sent me an unboxing of it, and I couldn't watch it because I was so excited to get mine. So I apologise. Oh, have I not done it enough? No, I haven't, have I? There we are. I don't want to give him a wedgie. I make it too, too, too tight. <laughs> right, so we've got... We even have paint in case he's chipped. I think that is... How many companies do you know send stuff like that? Where am I going to put... Where are you going to go? You're going to have to... Do you know what I think? You would look beautiful next to my Dumbledore's office cabinet next door.
talk about this Dobby for a moment. I mean, everyone knows that I'm not a humongous Dobby fan, right? However, when I saw this Dobby on the Muckle Mannequin website with, as Janice has, has, has mentioned many times, his golf ball eyes, his golf ball green eyes that really drew me to this figure because one of my favourite times of seeing Dobby is when Harry says to me, promise me you'll never try to save my life again. And he just looks at Harry and goes, hmm, that is this look. That is what he's saying here. He is just so full of love that this figure is just loved by millions. When we went to Dobby's grave in Fresh West, I actually got very tearful, tear, tear, tearful, tearful, because Janice and I were there on the exact spot where they buried him. And Janice has got a picture where she's holding Dobby. It's actually this picture, which I took, but Janice has actually sat on the very spot that Dobby was laid to rest in Freshwater West, at Shell Cottage, on the outskirts of Tinworth, but it's just such a beautiful place. And as Dobby says, such a beautiful place to be with friends. And this is just what I see Dobby as. Somebody who hasn't been a massive fan of Dobby for years, but this Dobby says it all because he is so lifelike. Those eyes are so real. The tufts of his little chin hair there and his hair on his head. I mean, he is just so beautiful. And his pillowcase outfit that's the sign of the, ha the mark of the house elf enslavement. A bit clean, isn't he? But that's how we'd want Dobby to be, really. We'd want him to be loved and clean. Trust me, you're going to be loved and clean in this house, my darling. This is just the most amazing figure. And it's the one out of all the Dobbies I've seen. And Janice has showed me a lot of Dobbies. And this one is the one that I love so very much. He has so much love in his heart in this statue. And I think he would protect anybody, just like he protects Harry in the films. He loves Harry so much. And that is the Dobby that's right in front of me now. He's beautiful. So this is Dobby's base. Isn't it perfect? Isn't it just so brilliant? He's walking along what looks like real tiles in the floor and they're the old I had these tiles in my old house right we pulled this curtain back in my front room and these are the tiles underneath the grout in the middle of these tiles is mental it's so real and then you've got this beautiful house our feet I mean maybe not beautiful we love Dobby but he's he needs to do his he needs a man a, a pedicure do you know what I mean Dobby you need a pedicure do you want one I can do one we'll do one later like have a little kind of, you know, a bonding, a bonding, bonding session, a bonding <laughs> session. I'll give you a whole facial. Yeah, I've got it all next door, honestly, I will. <laughs> we'll take care of those, with those little whiskers with Monono. <laughs> <laughs> Janice takes the mickey out of me using Monono. But I love Monono, my hair removal no no. I can get rid of my whiskers, it's great. I can do the same for you. Might not work on wire, but I can try. <laughs> want to mention the Harry Potter written there. This is the kind of almost like the old style, the Chamber of Secrets and the Philosopher's Stone have that kind of old style Harry Potter writing when you looked at the film and you watched the beginning, the credits. That's what I see there. That's, that's that kind of font there. So it's nice that they've got that connection. Although Dobby was in, you know, Deathly Hallows as well. With Creature and then Wicked Trainers. <laughs> So we're very gently turning Dobby round. So on the back then we have all the important information that I always tell you when it comes to collecting, make sure if something says it's official, it has the official details on the back, the side, the top, but make sure it has it written on it. It'll always have the stamp of Warner Brothers on there. And this of course, very importantly, has the Harry Potter stamp 
it's got the Warner Brothers stamp there and of course the Muckle Mannequins stamp there as well. Remember these are pieces of artwork okay they go up in value and how would you not want this Dobby to be in the middle of your home welcoming you home just like they welcome ho everyone back to Hogwarts. He can welcome you back to your home like you're in Hogwarts. How about that? So he is just incredible. Now this is Dobby DO2. So this is Dobby part two or take two. I've got to be honest, I prefer this one to the original because he is just beautiful. I'm still staring at his feet. They don't smell, which is a good thing. If it was my feet, they'd smell. Um, but this is beautiful. I love all the markings around the edges. There's this kind of like this oldie woldy look. A little bit like Malfoy Manor, obviously, which Janice will probably hate me for mentioning with Malfoys. Um, you know, she's giving me dirty looks. Uh, but then you've got this almost like um, Ministry of Magic kind of style paintwork, if that makes sense, which is one of my favorite scene, uh, sceneries from Harry Potter. I love that. But this base is beautifully made absolutely beautifully made i don't know where i'm going to put in why janice is sleeping here because there's no room and she might steal you he's sleeping with me tonight no he's not <laughs> I'll, I'll kick adam out if i have to <laughs> you're gonna sleep with me it's okay don't worry um but i'm gonna i'm gonna have to check she doesn't take him home with her she might do check me back can you can you leave me your car keys <laughs> <laughs> so i can at least check you and take him home you won't hear me, you wear earplugs. If I wake up tomorrow and you're not here, the first thing I'm going to do is check for Dobby. <laughs> Give me a sock. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> yeah, if you give him a sock, then he can come home with me. No. <laughs> do you want to come home with me, Dobby? No, yes. you is staying here. <laughs> you is staying with me, your new owner. Wow, you're so beautiful. Is he actually friends? with the creature in the corner over there. I don't know. I might have to keep them in separate rooms. Mm. Well, you are. You're going to go in the other room. You are. You are beautiful. I want to stare at you all the time when I'm in the room watching something like Bones <laughs> or Buffy or even Harry Potter. You'll have to stand him near the TV so his eyes are facing the TV so it looks like he's watching the telly. I love that idea. That's so good. He is so cute. Say it with me. He is so cute. Oh, he is so cute. Aren't you, Dobby? He is so beautiful. So between this and my Niffler, I have seriously been spoiled by Muckle Mannequins. I am so, so lucky. And he's so beautifully made. You're a very lucky lady. Yeah. him are you looking to get one they are marked as sold out on the website so make sure that you message uh, muckle mannequins because i'm sure they'll be getting more in stock um they're priced at what was it through 1055 euros um to buy which i think because we've just put him together he's so well made oh yeah definitely Again, a work of art, absolutely beautiful. It's a bit fiddly to get him on the base, so it will definitely need more than one of you to get it done. Um, but that way, at least you know he's done very well. So uh, let me know what you think of him. Until next time, take care. We love you all, and we'll speak to you very soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. My content take a look at this video right here or this video right here don't forget to like and subscribe